She's Julie Pleck, executive producer of The CW Hits, The Vampire Diaries, The Originals, and The Tomorrow People. As an extra for her fans, she's here to answer your social media questions. They love you, Julie. They love and hate okay. me. <laughs> All right, at L. Shore Fern asks, if you've seen the petition with over 20,000 signatures asking about Claroline. I have seen so many petitions for so many couples and so many characters. Um, they they love petitions, and uh, and it's good to you know see what the fan base is really fighting for. Does it affect you? It it either makes me feel very good or very guilty, depending on what choice I'm about to make. Modern Scarlet asks: there Any hope for Klaus and Caroline to be together in the future? Klaus and Caroline have uh, an eternity of opportunity. Um, so depending on how you define future, maybe one day. Julie, this sounds soap opera -ish. <laughs> Well, these particular fans really like this relationship. <laughs> At The Real Sunrise One, what's next for Delina, Damon, and Alina? <laughs> Will they continue to defeat all their obstacles and challenges? Um, you know, as is always the case in a good love story, there will never not be obstacles and challenges, but they, and they will have a doozy of one to get past, but uh, they're going to try to work it through. At uh, Real Sunrise One wants to know if there's a possibility for a Caroline and Stefan romance in the future. See, you're right, it is a soap opera. <laughs> uh, I think anything's possible. At Lord Menia tweets, where did the original vampire werewolf idea come from? It was actually a book series called The Vampire Diaries that was written back in the early 90s by L.J. Smith and uh, sat around for 20 years before we made it. At One Lexa Victoria wants to know if there will be a time where Stefan focuses on being happy and worry-free. I think Stefan is too neurotic to ever, ever truly be worry-free. Uh, I think that's part of his charm, but definitely we want him to find happiness, too. At Fen Veranti Viral asks, what's the last book you read? I read most recently the, gosh, and I loved it, um, The Leftovers by Tom Parada. At McKinney here asks, are there frequent rewrites on the set? No, not really. We, we tend to shoot what we write, at least we try to. And McKinney here also wants to know how long the writing, filming, and post-production process is before we see an episode. Usually it takes about two weeks to figure out what the episode is, about 10 days to write it and write it well, eight days to shoot it, about three weeks to put it into post, and then it's usually on the air within six weeks of the, of the beginning. Is the idea person always the writer, or they can be two different people? You usually have a nice big group of people that sit in the writer's room, and we all come up with everything together, and then you assign a script to somebody specific. Kara McKinnon on Facebook, if you plan on resurrecting Cole on the originals. Uh, anything can happen, although currently, currently uh, he's busy on another show. Tia Van Helmert, apparently this is big. Any hope for Stefan and Elena? Yes, well, the same people that fight very hard for Damon and Elena, there's a good force of people who fight for Stefan and Elena, and all I can say to them is you just have to watch and see where life takes these, these guys. These fans are really involved. They're right? really, they're beautifully involved. Chucky2020 asks if you're working on another show for the future. I have an idea buried in the recesses of my brain that one day when I get more than two days off, I might try to see what I can do with it. And lastly, at its Jenny1120, what is your favorite thing about your fans and what do you like most about the Vampire Diaries? My favorite thing about the fans is their passion and their commitment. They have won us Teen Choice Awards, People's Choice Awards, every single blogger that does any kind of contest, like what's your favorite romantic pairing on television? I think we beat out Ross and Rachel on Friends and on <laughs> one of them. Um, and they're very, very dedicated and very, very vocal and has kept the show alive. One more thing. TVD Delena 852. What are your plans for future seasons? Any new permanent characters? And how many seasons? Well, we think the show can keep going and going. It depends on really who wants to keep doing it with us. Uh, definitely, we will be seeing some familiar faces again, and we will be introducing some new characters next year as well. You're a delight, Julie. Thank you. You're very good at your job. Good luck on fixing <laughs> Fix things. The fixer. You ever need a host on the Vampire Diaries, I could come in. Absolutely. I got an idea. I interview one of the vampires, and you kill me. Perfect. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Why did you kill Larry? I want to thank my guest, Julie Pleck, for sitting down with me today and answering your social media questions. You can find Julie on Twitter at Julie Pleck, and you can find me on King's Things, and I'll see you the next time. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday through Thursday, on demand on Hulu and Aura.tv.